you'll be good, you'll be good. I love your outfit. Where was it made? Was it made in Nigeria? Did you have a local designer making? Made in Nigeria. Yes, period. <laughs> so where are you from? I'm from the Navy, and I'm So Bestie. is this like um, designated for your tribe? Like is the fabric related specifically to people from Iniwi? Well, it's not for Navy alone. Okay, but okay. This material. Yes. This George. Okay. So it's very relevant to my culture. So you find a lot of us using it for our traditional weddings. Nice, yeah. nice. That your outfit is so pretty. I love Thank it. You. Do you want to do a shoe cam? Yeah. 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 Come on, come, come, come. Give us a quick shoe cam. You just shot. <laughs> Woo, look, look at that. And you can give us on the side as well. Like, yes, yes, lovely. So can you teach me one word that is associated with your tribe? Just one word. Just one word. Njodum. What does that mean? <laughs> what, what is it? What is it? Yeah. Say that it. is very Newi tradition. So if I say that in Newi, say Njodum, or you say Njodum, uh -huh. uh -huh. that is it. Period, uh -huh. right? That's not me. That's, oh, that's not me? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yes, uh -huh. Uh -huh. So once I say, they know that I've been uh -huh. to your village. They would say you're from Newi. God said, ask you, are you from Newi? <laughs> I'm from the West. I'm actually from Ogun State. Oh, nice. So, like, what do you call this outfit that you're wearing? This is called Agbada. Okay. Only rich people wear this, by the way. So if you see people in the building wearing this, you can ask them for dollars, okay? <laughs> they have lots of money. We have shoe cam over here. You can just style your shoes in the summer. Yeah. Awesome. No, you can come in. You can come in. I'm Sarah. What's your name? Hi, Sarah. I'm Nicole. Hi, Nicole. How are you? Good. How are you? And what's your name? My name is Nora Jess, and I'm here bringing greetings from the Minister of Immigration, Labor and wow. Skills, Minister Balser, who could not be here, but sends her warmest wishes and for a successful event and wish she could have been here. Well, thank you so much. We're happy to have you guys. Is this your first Nigerian Night event? I've, I've been to a couple of uh, smaller scale, but not the big one. Yes, right. we're so glad, like, no COVID, we're allowed yeah. to party. Yeah, so I'm really excited for you guys. What are you most excited about for the evening? There's awards tonight, right? Yes. I know I know some people who are up for some of the awards, so I'm looking forward to that. Who are you rooting for? For Hallie. Yay, so when Hallie wins, I want to hear you cheer, okay? You will. Well, thank you so much for sharing the stage with me. I really appreciate it. And you guys look really nice. We have a shoe cam. So, yes, so you can come give us a quick shoe cam. Yes! <laughs> Yeah, lovely! Awesome! Is this Nigerian wedding or party, yeah. this is how you know the rich women. Ah. <laughs> so come collect some money from her tonight. <laughs> Once you see Gele, just know the person has money. So you can. <laughs> Look at that. Come, come, come give us some shoe pants. Yes. Looking forward to for the rest of the evening. Oh my gosh, I'm ready for the uh, celebration. I'm ready for the food, the dance, the uh, everything. Just bring it on. What makes you most proud being Nigerian? Oh my gosh, everything. I am a proud Nigerian woman from Igbo. Yeah. Yay! How do we say hi in Igbo? Kedu. Kedu. Yes. Nigeria has so many tribes, so if you're in the building today, you need to learn at least one way to say hi in a Nigerian language. The first one is... <laughs> well, thank you so much for sharing the stage with me. I appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your evening. excited about for the evening? I'm most excited to be with my Nigerian brothers and sisters. Yes. Are you looking forward to a particular meal? Like, what, what do you know about the Nigerian food? I just know that I love it all, so I don't know what I love the most. I know the Nigerian Ghana are always uh, about the uh, jollof oh. rice. <laughs> 
Well, you made me do it. Uh -huh. Nigerian Jalal for Ghana and Jalal. Well, you remember you're at Nigerian night. Okay. Choose wisely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll send everyone to come gango. Choose wisely. Don't forget. I'm going to choose wisely tonight for Nigerian Jalal friends. We want. We want no corruption here. We want. Where is your outfit from? What are you wearing tonight? Oh, tonight I'm wearing a, uh, a PC blue caucus uh, dress coat. Well, blue is your color for sure. You like the blue? I love the blue. Do you want to do a quick shoe cam? Okay, sure. Right here. Let's see your shoes. Show up and show out. <laughs> I think I had the wrong shoes on time. No, these are beautiful. Well, these are really beautiful. Like if you come to a Nigerian event, the fashion is the big thing, so okay. we you are here to be treated like like a royal. So we want you to know you are royal. So oh, you you outdid yourself. <laughs> <laughs> well, is this your first Nigerian night? This is this is my first, and I'm looking forward to having a good time. Today, nice. So. Are you impressed so far? So far, yeah. Um, it it's, uh, seems to be like a good crowd. Um, Lots of folks here, and there's a few here that I already know, so okay. I'm excited about that. And of course, the company I'm with tonight is also is also great. So, what, what company are you with? I'm with uh, two colleagues from the uh, the PC party, Co okay. uh, Mosier and uh, Nargis. Uh, nice. with, she's with the immigration uh, uh, portfolio. So yeah, it's, it's, I'm looking forward to it. It's really lovely to see our city being represented with diversity. So I'm really glad you're here tonight. Absolutely. What um, are you looking forward to the most for the rest of the evening? I'm looking forward to connecting with people, networking, and um, meeting lots of folks in the Nigerian community. Awesome. So um, today I'm going to teach you a Nigerian word. So if you go around in the room and you're meeting people, you can keep the formalities and just say how far. That's how we greet in Nigerian. So how far? How far? It doesn't mean distance, okay? okay. It's just what's up? Okay. All right. I got that. <laughs> so you can say how far when you meet a person and they'll get it. Okay. You feel very Nigerian. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, I just want to ask where your outfit is from. Oh, from Calabar Cross River State to oh, Nigeria. Nice. Yep. Is, is it called a specific thing? Yes, it is. So for the men, um, this is a traditional shet. It's made of a boil or lace, but okay. I chose boil today. Okay. And this is a damask, traditional damask okay. from Caliban. So this is royalty. I love it. Like the whole outfit is given. We have shoe cam. You can just woo. Okay, look at that. You wanna do a quick spin? Oh yes. Yeah, sure. I, I love the scarf. Like this is there's nothing regal more than this. Oh thank you. Yeah, I really love it. Does it is this the hat too that you wear with the outfit? Yes, so okay. this is the traditional hat that goes with this. So this is a complete dressing for the men and okay. this is actually hand woven. So it takes a lot of hard work and love to create this and it goes with this. Typically, how much would you say like this outfit would go for? It would go for yeah. um, so the damask, um, this is actually an imported fabric. So it comes in and of course, you know, the Calabar people are, you know, have this thought with Europeans. Um, yeah. It was the very first spot of call when they came into Nigeria. So this is actually imported. I don't know how much this is in in the Valley of Naira. You get what I mean right now? Yeah. But um, with this look, you could... You want me to give you in Canadian dollars or Naira? Yeah, Canadian dollars is fine. I just want to get like an Canadian idea. Canadian dollars. So we're talking about maybe 2,000, 3,000 Canadian dollars. Wow. There's nothing more regal than this. Oh. This is the modernized fashion of it. Yes. Because um, our mothers never had all those. Yes. It was just the plain. <laughs> so yeah, this is a, it. It's got to be tied up and then it's got to flow down because they, they Im imitate the Elizabethan dressing. Oh. So you know that Elizabethan dwelling is always with the corset up here yes, tight yes, and yes, then down yes. flowing so that. I swear I didn't know that. That's really good information. You look really lovely. I need to do shoe cam. And the fur. When we meet, we dress to impress. That's it. Hey, sorry, what's your name? Hola. And um, what's your role for the Nigerian Association? I'm the Vice President. And what has been the most exciting thing about your journey so far? Just being the opportunity to work with different people, uh, collaborate to plan events such as this, and actually add value back to the community. What are you looking forward to the most for the rest of the evening? 
I'm hoping that everyone has a wonderful time tonight and at the end of the day we all go home with smiles on our faces. Well, thank you so much VP. Thank you for all the work that you do. Thank you so much. Yeah, he said, he yeah, said yeah, you need to interview me abroad. Yeah, is this your own eh? Is me to match Nigeria? Only you wear your crown. Only you wear your bag, but a true representing all parts of Nigeria. Wazobia. <laughs> yes, Wazobia. United Nigeria. Eh? Yeah. United Nigeria. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you. Where's the Alsa part of it? Um, Alsa here is a few managers. Okay, Shukam. Where is your outfit from? What part of Nigeria is your outfit uh, from? This outfit is from the eastern part of the country and um, an Ambra state precisely. Yes, so once you see Isiago, no. You know where it is? Man. Yes, you know that the chief is in the building. Exactly. <laughs> and the staff. This is where you get your blessing or your curses. Choose wisely. <laughs> Can anybody dress like this? Why not? It's a national dress. Just like a uh, Anybody from the eastern part of the country can wear an attire from any other part of the country. They can also wear this one. So I know that in the Igbo culture they have like the red hats and then they have the black ones. Is there like a difference? Of course. Uh, before you wear a red cap, you must have been made a chief okay. by your community. Okay. For now, I'm still aspiring to be a chief. I'm not a chief yet, but um, um, Probably very soon I'll be a chief. So if we see someone wearing the red one, we know that, that person is a chief. And then if you're wearing the black one, um, I would say yes and no. Back home, uh, anybody who is wearing a red cap will most probably be a chief. But here, anybody can buy any any cap and wear. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you know, nobody is checking that out. So I better wait until I am made a chief. Well, you are a chief in our eyes, so thank you so much for having... I think I have all the qualities to be made a chief. Well, I've seen a lot of Agbada today, but this one is very jazzed up. Where is your outfit from? Thank you. This is uh, from um, Yoruba land. Uh, this is uh, in Yoruba land, we call this Aron. And um, the down part is called the Asho Oke. And uh, just a mix of color to show diversity that Nigeria, we have all manners of tribe, all manners of strength. And uh, it is beautiful to see the colorful event today and uh, celebrating Nigeria, celebrating gifts, talent, and uh, all the good stuff that we stand for in Nova Scotia. Yes, I really, really like your outfit, the color. The, yeah, it's really, really nice. Like, like I said, I've seen a lot of Agbada and this one stands out, yeah. Thank you. But thank you so much for sharing the stage with me. I really appreciate it. Yes, thank you. But enjoy the rest of your evening. And God bless Nigeria. Yes, God bless Nigeria. Okay, Mr. Nigeria. Okay, um, I hold the welfare office. I'm the welfare officer for the Nigerian Association. Nice. What do you guys have planned for us tonight? Oh, we got a lot in stock for you. That's why we encourage everyone to come around and come have fun. Well, thank you. Where's your outfit from and what tribe in Nigeria does it represent? Okay, I represent the Yoruba tribe and my outfit is from um, Nigeria. <laughs> did you what, what part of Nigeria, what city did you get your dress name? Oh, Lagos, of course. It's like everyone 
had your dresses made in Lagos, right? Yes, as well. We have one of the best, you know, fashion designers. So. Well, you look nice, and thank you so much for sharing this tune with me. Thank you for having me. Hi, how are you? Thank you. What's your name? My name is Jane. How are you, Jane? What are you wearing tonight? Oh, well, I'm wearing uh, Ankara. Okay. In a very fashionable way. Well, I got to get a spin. Yeah. Yes. Give us a full spin, 360, please. And thank you. We have Shu Kang over here. Yes. I think blue is your color. Yes. <laughs> Where in Nigeria are you from? I'm from Delta State. Oh, you're my sister. Are you? Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Delta too. Where in Delta? I'm horrible. Uh, Migo. Oh, you can't say Migo to me. No, no. I should say Migo to you. Migo. Yes. If you don't know, if you're from Delta, when you say Mingua, and exactly, and then Re means get up, and then Do means you can go. Thank you. You're blessed. Well, thank you. It's good to get another sister in the house. I appreciate you. But thank you. Myself, so I, yeah, I mix those myself. So, do you have this stuff in Halifax? Yes. So, what's the name of your business? Dex to Dinner Styles. Do you have a card, like a page, an Instagram? Yes, I have. Yes, 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 on Instagram. Yes. Yes. Yeah, what's your Instagram handle? Um, Dex to Dinner Styles. Okay, awesome. Well, guys, if you want to look this amazing, you need to run to Instagram right now to get this because you can get this in Halifax. This is real stuff. And look at this, this is beautiful. What do you call this in Nigerian culture? Yeah, yeah you have to say it and represent. You, you're here to show up and show out. Where is this from? What is it called? Well, it's called Agbada. Be dead Agbada, like hands. We have shoe cam. Come, yes, come on, come on, come on. Let's, let's do a quick shoe cam. Look at those. You cannot meet a Nigerian that is not showing up and showing out. I love your outfit. But guys, if you want to look this beautiful, check out our Instagram page. You can look like royal in Halifax. <laughs> 